TOEFL classes. Today's TOEFL class is TOEFL Junior Level Day Wise Practice Sheets. And the classes are 6th and 7th, uh, day is 10, and the date is 29th of August 2023. So, for today's first component to learn is reading comprehension. Dear students, Sikramir Chodande, read the following uh, diagram, the table called the diagram, and answer the question. Sikramir ki, okay, diagram undi. If you have a diagram, generally, data is diagrammatically represented in pie charts, uh, column charts, next, uh, tables, and uh, other charts. We use these charts. This is called bar graph. This bar graph is called data. is called bar graph. This bar graph is called bar graph. This bar graph is called bar graph. This one is the x axis, horizontal. Right, this is the y axis the vertical. Gaunde. bars can be found. right side children day blue color pulses, red color grains. Right, and a blue color la only bars and the pulses indicate chest there. Red color la only bars and the grains indicate chest there. Could x axis lemon gave it chero data years on a two thousand sixteen seventeen. 17 18 years in the numbers. Lo. So each one is 20 gap, lo 20, 40, and this is 30, 20, 30, 30, 40, this is 50, like that. For example, 180, this red color is 200, 180, 190. And this red one is 160, and 160, this is 170. So like that, you have to understand. So, if you have a detail, you can see the bar graph. Then we will go for the questions. If you have a pass, we will go for the questions. Now, answer the following questions. What does the chart tell about? So, the chart is intelligent. The production of grains and pulses. And what is the heading? Food production, uh, production of food, pulses and grains. So that is the answer. Next, among, among, the, among food grains and pulses, which one shows constant growth? So, this pulses and grains are constant growth. In the world. Right? So, what is the constant growth? In the world? This is the blue growth. Verify chair, next one red verify chair. This blue juice is So 130, 150, again 150, and 190. And red is down, decrease, 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 increase. So constant growth is in this blue color bar. Blue color bar indicates pulses. So the answer is. Among food grains and the pulses, which one shows constant growth? So, pulses are constant growth. We have two pistons. This is the blue color. Next. Which is the only year where, which is the only year where pulses production overtook food grains production? And overtook and then the other game is in the end. Echo is in the end. A year low, monkey pulses production, food grains can echo is in the So, pulses and the blue. Food grains and this is equal to the blue. Blue is equal to blue. Second one 2017 18 is equal to the blue. And this is equal to the blue. So, this is equal to the blue. The answer is none of the above. Next, fourth one uh, in which year the production of pulses and food grains were equal? Equal to equal. And this is equal to the blue. This is equal to the so, what do you want to get here? 2018 and 19. 2018 and 19 is the answer. Next, fifth one. In which year the production of food grain reached 170 units? So, food grains 170 units. Food grains and red color. 170 units are red color. This one. Here are 2017 and 18. So the answer is 
A. So these are the answers of our reading comprehension. Now we'll move on to the second component, language, form and meaning. Here Henry loved to play around with machi machines, right? Indian Abhayke machines third kodo chala If his brothers and sisters got wind up toys for Christmas, well, uh, athan brothers ki sisters gani wind up toys. Wind up toys and dainty, man keys the man ke movement hoyi well thay jisara. These toys are called uh, wind up toys. Christmas gani gifts ke andos the, they had to hide them. Well, that's called it. Hide them because Henry always so the eight times on the manaki that loud past tense on the Henry always to go to past tense and took took them apart. What we did is see to see how they worked at the very day so started apart and Henry and the one lathan brothers and sisters who are the Dutchess over at Christmas coach 20 toy gifts. He is a tinkerer, not farmer. His father used to say the tinkerer and dente uh, even uh, uh, materials ni, and machines ni, open JC uh, Mali Bigister Zusara, okay, experimenting uh, one tinkerer under. Annual father and ever Dash, he was in Detroit. Claimus uh, Nimanke, how he was Radu, which he was Radu, when was in the time Kadamanke, when he was in Detroit, Detroit Lunda Dabudu. He Mankandrake tells Detroit is the uh, most famous city in US of uh, I think in Michigan, Michigan state la the day. Very famous for uh, cars. Henry heard that the first motor cars were being made in Europe. Henry entered cars Europe la thayar hoti nai Next, like today's cars, they used gasoline to make their engines go. Gasoline whatever, and petrol whatever. People were amazed by them, but thought they were very so uh chala asheringa to say or at a prazal of petrol use to internet the first time gada so uh, they thought that uh, but it, they thought they were very 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 intended adverb adverb that they was monkey adjectives in the told the danger is the noun dangerous is the adjective and danger is the verb dangerously is the another uh, adverb. So very uh, dangerous. Chala dangerous and bavinchari. This is the answer. In Britain, Dash had to walk in front of slowly moving cars, waving red flag as warning. Warning a red flag is then a wave jeste. Yavar koda a car mundu nandu In Britain, no one had to. No one had to. No one answered. No one had to walk in front of slowly. Moving car waving a red flag as a warning. So these are the answers of our uh, language form and meaning. Now we'll come to uh, speaking about uh, water sources. Ekramman ki the read aloud task idi. Ekrami ko ka screen me the text osundi, voice kado osundi. You just see the text and listen to the voice and repeat the sounds of those uh, words. Which are uttered. Start at the money, uh, Please get ready to listen to that. Many people work to provide water for farming and industry and for the home. Most of the fresh water that people use comes from rivers, lakes, or under the ground. People build reservoirs to store this water. They also build pipes to take it to different places. In places where there isn't enough water, volunteers sometimes work with local people to build wells to provide water for families. They also help to keep water in wells and springs as clean as possible. Most of Earth's water is salt water in the oceans or frozen into ice. Only about 1% can be used by people for drinking, cooking, washing, farming, and industry.
Many people work to provide water for farming and industry and for the home. Most of the fresh water that people use comes from rivers, lakes, or under the ground. People build reservoirs to store this water. They also build pipes to take it to different places. In places where there isn't enough water, volunteers sometimes work with local people to build wells to provide water for families. They also help to keep water in wells and springs as clean as possible. Most of Earth's water is salt water in the oceans or frozen into ice. Only about 1% can be used by people for drinking, cooking, washing, farming, and industry. Now we'll go to the last one, listening comprehension. So, Miru is the interview in Vinandi. Later, we go on to the answering the given questions. Come in and take a seat, Steve. Thank you. So, you're looking for a summer job? Do you have any hotel experience? I'm afraid not. My parents have a shop and I sometimes help out when they're busy. Well, a lot of our visitors don't speak English. Can you speak any other languages? My parents are from Spain, so my Spanish is very good. And I know some French. Okay, good. What about German? I know a few words, but I can't speak it very well. Now, we need people who can drive because the hotel is a long way from the town and there aren't any buses. Well, I can drive, but I don't have a car. I want a summer job so I can buy one. But it's okay because I have a motorcycle. That's great. What about computers? Can you use a computer? Yes, I'm very good with computers. I'm studying computing in college. Once a week, we have Italian food and music night for our visitors. Can you sing or play a musical instrument? Well, I know some Italian songs, but I'm not a very good singer. But I can play the guitar quite well, and I'm a very good dancer. I know lots of Italian dances. Great. Well, thanks very much for coming here. We'll call you next week about the job. So, you are listening to the now we'll come to the questions. Which language do Steve's parents speak? So, Spanish. Next, Steve said, I'm very good with computers. It means, good with computers and other than he can work with computers. Computers to work. Which instrument can Steve play? It's very clearly given guitar. What is the purpose of the talk? He talk then Gurunji. Is the food, driving, dance and music as its job interview? Where does Steve want to work? Okay, I can work in a hotel, an office, in a theater, in a school. So, in a hotel. Hotel work in a So, these are all the answers. I think you have gone through all these things. Keep learning. Have a good day. Bye. See you.